Hi, I'm Justin Allegri, and this is your Wednesday edition of Inside the Show. In the National League Central, the Brewers' closer, number 14, got his first career win as Milwaukee downed the Rockies 3-2. The Cards got 12 hits in this one as they nabbed the win against the visiting Cubs 8-6. The San Francisco Giants launched three home runs as they got a road win against Arizona 4-0. The Dodgers combined to allow only four hits as they bested the visiting Padres 4-0. The Yankees allowed only five hits as they destroyed the Rays 12 to nothing. The Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim had 12 hits as a team as they defeated the A's in Oakland 7 to 2. The Indians Sun starting to set now over Great American Ballpark in Cincinnati. Time for game two of the regular season between the Philadelphia Phillies and the Cincinnati Reds. Who's going to win the battle between these two? We'll see next. Sammy Ellis, a right-handed Georgia native, gets the starting nod. Harold, what do you got? Well, Matt, this guy's not going to blow you away. He's a consistent major league pitcher. Look, his ERA last year a little bit over four, but he takes the baseball. And he's a guy that's going to take his lump, but he's going to keep coming back at you. And I think we'll probably see that kind of performance today. Digging in, Leading off Tony tonight for Gonzalez. He'll get Fielder. us started in this one Number under 25. the lights. And Harold, as we take a look at the Reds entering play here tonight, they're coming off a good victory here in front of the home faithful on opening day. It is so nice, Matt, to win that home opener. You know the next day the crowd is going to be hyped. Everybody's talking baseball in the city. And now you're back for game two. And he is going to have extra bases to start the evening. And he's in at second base with a first inning double. Now that is the way you want to start a game on the road. He comes out swinging and stands second. at second Left as the fielder. first base runner of the night. Nice. Now we'll Covington. see if his teammates can pick him up and if they can punch first. Wes Covington is next as he finds himself behind 0-1. Outside for a ball, 1-1. One one. Well, his job right there at the plate is to move that runner over to third by getting the ball to the right side. On the mound, though, they're working him away so he doesn't have a good pitch to do that with. Now a fastball awfully close but he doesn't get the call it's two and two now grounded to third and the throw to first is in time one gun. With that here's the starting lineup for the visiting Philadelphia Phillies. Harold what's their focus as they go for their first win. Well the key to me in this one I'm going to throw a cliche at you Matt you know I don't use many cliches. I would have to say have great energy play with some enthusiasm be excited about playing and if they do that man they carry it through for nine innings look out mm, he's right on that breaking ball that's pretty good timing right there especially falling up after a fastball Ooh, that's one he wants back right now man it looked like his timing was perfect he just didn't barrel it up good job to spoil that one away and he stays alive 2 2 here it is. And a breaking ball in the dirt that time for a ball. Well, we're playing cat and mouse already in the first inning. Look, I know it's a three ball count, but I don't think he's pitching around it because look at the on deck circle. That guy's a pretty good hitter, too. Swing and a little blooper to center. Robinson coming in. In there, a base hit. Yeah, he's not fooling anybody so far, Matt. Like you said, that's the second Batting double four. he's given up right here. Fielder. And if he doesn't get things Johnny figured out, Callister. it's going to be a real short outing. 0 1, here's the pitch. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0 2. He appears to be having some issues with pitch command to start the game. He's dealing with two guys on, and that last pitch looked like a big mistake in that location, right down the middle, but he got away with it. Now a swing, and he just fouls this one away. That's a nice job of staying alive. A two-strike breaking ball just out of the zone. He was able to put enough on it to get another pitch. That was a fourth foul ball in this at bat. Meanwhile, this ball gets down. It's a base hit. And the runner from third crosses the plate. Tack on another here as the runner scores from second. It's a 2-0 ball game. He's Not set. Here it comes. First now a fastball yeah. runs inside and drills him. Oh, that's got to hurt. 
batting six. Catcher. Number 11. First pitch coming. Here it is. Good swing. Just got to try and straighten that one out. Looks like the Reds are going to have some stirring in the bullpen as the lefties begun to heat up down there. Tries to shave the corner with that pitch, but it's one and one. Fought off at the plate as it's chopped foul. Runners are at first and second with one away. And another foul ball. I like the pitch right there. Got it to chase a fastball out of the zone. I'd come back with it again. A fastball here, and this is softly hit and fouled off to the left. A bullet to first base. In now, number 13. And we'll see what he can do here. Two on, two away, two home so far this inning. I think this inning could have far-reaching effects in this game. They're really making him work, and unless he dials it in, it's probably going to limit how deep he goes into this game. And here's a fastball on 0-2, but it misses. One and two now. And that's through into center field. Base hit. Long throw to the plate. And they're not going to get him. He's in there at the plate. Oh, ground ball up the middle. That's going to score a run right there. That's a Johnny nice Hayes. job of just staying Second up the middle, not trying to pull Tony the ball or get Taylor. out. Of oh, and while we talked, that pitch got away and ended up hitting him. So he'll head down to first on Johnny the hit by pitch. Petra. Chris. Here comes the first Short. pitch. Chris Short is at the plate as he watches ball one. Here's the 1 0. And he gets a piece here as this ball is fouled away. He's clearly looking to hit off the fastball and adjust. That's a pretty good swing after seeing two fastballs now in a row. Look, 2 and 0 oh to the pitcher in this situation with the bases loaded. You have to challenge him. Make him swing the bat. Here's one that misses inside, and the counts run full now. 3 and 2. He's not having his best outing in this one, and I think that curveball is part of the reason why. He couldn't get on top of that one, and that's not the first time that's happened. Has to challenge him now. Here's the pitch. And he strikes him out here, so he's able to stop the bleeding a bit as the side. Do get three that inning. That's the good news. The bad news is they leave three men on base. Chris Short will be on the bump for game two of the Leading series. The Harold, any thoughts? Matt, last year he won Number 19 games. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. Around first, he's digging for second. And he's in there safely. He's got a double. Left fielder really never had a chance at that one at all. Second it was over run. his head before he knew he, it. Bouncing oh. off the base of the wall for an easy double. Those are the kind of shots anyone would feel good about. Well hit the other way, and it's into the gap. And that'll put him on the board as it's now a 3-1 to one contest. Back-to-back -back doubles now, and that's a great way to get an inning going. The leadoff man good. shows him how it's right done, fielder. and he comes right behind him following Robinson. suit. Lacing a double of his own could be a big... There's a swing and a high, deep drive headed for the right field corner. And that's taken in near the line as the runner tags from second. And he'll make it up to third safely here with one away. Time now for a look at the Adding hometown four. Reds starting lineup third card in this line. one. Harold, Number what's the 12. key for him against one of the best starters in the game? Well, you come in and you realize, man, we're already down two. What do you do? You play within yourself. Throw to first is in time, but meanwhile, the runner is in to score. Hey, a simple ground ball to the infield, but the run does come home from third, and they cut their deficit to only one run. Big curveball swung on and missed 0 and 1. These Phillies, Harold, as they enter play here tonight, they started the season out on the wrong foot, dropping one on the road on opening day. Well, here you are, game two. You try to get into somewhat of a, of a routine. You know, game one, you got so many people opening day, throwing out first pitch, ceremony for dignitaries, you name it. That's not the real flow to a game. Now game two, even though you're on the road, you want to try to get into a little bit of a routine, and maybe that'll help them win this game. And he'll just fight this one off as it's chopped foul. Here's another 0-2. Slow roller back to the mound. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. 
trying to pick things up where we left off. Leading off with Tony Gonzalez. He'll lead things off Tony here in this one run Gonzalez. contest. Bounce to first. Perez comes up with it. And he'll take this to the bag himself. And the leadoff man set down now to start back. the second. Left fielder, Wes Covington. Hold high in the air out to right field. Robinson is there. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. Now batting. Ready for another chance. Dick Allen. A little bouncer. That's a foul ball. The windup and the 0 1. And look out! That's the third batter hit by a pitch, and this could become a big problem. The right oh, and that was a six. big mistake right Johnny there. This guy Allison. might be their best base stealing threat in the lineup, so now he's got a chance to move into scoring position without even putting the ball into play. Stepping in now, Johnny Callison, as he'll swing and hit this one hard, but foul off to the left and out of play. Oh, he's clearly hitting off the fastball right there. You don't hit one that hard if you're not looking for it. That misses wide. One ball and one strike. Pitch is a cold strike, the throw, and it skips in as he steals the bag easily. There's a high foul ball as it finds a lucky fan in the upper deck for a souvenir. Well, I think he's trying to get that two-strike fastball out of the zone. Just caught too much of the plate right there. Fortunately, he fouled it off instead of putting it in the seats. And he comes back with one down and in for ball three. Dick Stewart would be next. That's lifted the other way out to left. Harper is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. Stepping up now, Tommy Leading Helms. Up He'll start us out here the in the home stop. half of the second. Tommy Helms. First pitch hack in here, and that's the first strike. The 0 1 on its way. Changeup gets him out in front for strike two. Beautiful changeup. Got him out front with that swing right there. That's what a changeup will do. Just keep you off balance. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. All right, here's how the Phillies line up defensively, brought to you by Majestic. In this day and age, when teams are moving all over the place playing the shift, these guys are old school, very traditional. You don't see the shift applied very often this way. And into center field as he's aboard with a one out single. Well, if I'm pitching, I got to be shaking my head. That's the last thing I'm thinking is he's going to hit a eight. ball down and away Catcher. and handle it Number as well nine. as he did to get a base hit. Digging in, number nine. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. And the runner back in standing. Runner goes for second. Pitch is a cold strike. The throw. Oh. Not in time as he steals second. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. Pitch outside the throw. Not nearly in time as he takes third easily. One out and a runner on third. Trying to bunt here, but this winds up hitting him. And they're going to say that he went after it. A strange strike, too. Hit high in the air down the right field line. Catch is made near the line. Here comes the runner from third. And he will score on the sacrifice fly as that ties our ball game at 3-3. Three to three. Stepping up to the plate, Sammy Ellis. Bases empty and two gone following the sacrifice fly. Line drive to left. And the pitcher's got himself a base hit. That is a big hit right there. When you can help yourself out, a little two-out uh, base hit, extends the inning, brings the top of the order up now. Standing in now, number 28. As he puts it on the ground to third. He's got to hurry. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. It's a run on two hits here for Cincinnati. Leading off for Philadelphia. First Sends baseman. that one out of play yeah. for strike one. 
pulled high in the air out to left field. Harper moves over. One away. The batter. Digging in to try 11. it again. Number 11. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. This is line to left. And that's into the outfield for a one out base hit. Well, Matt, this looks like it's going to be some kind of offense. That's the ninth hit between the two teams with that single right there. Man, are we 13. watching an offensive outburst in just three innings so far? Into the box, number 13, as he will take a fastball in there at the knees for strike one. A base hit in his first trip. 0 1 pitch, and he can't make contact on the bender. 0 and 2. Well, he's got him thinking right now. There's a fastball, then he comes back at the curveball and gets him out in front. I think when you get him out in front like that, you come back and throw another curveball right here. And a fastball swung on and missed as he just reared back there. Two away. The batter, Stepping in and Ready for another Second shot. Basement. Tony Taylor. Tony. Oh, and this one ran in and got him. And that's twice now he's been hit in this one. Well, Matt, if I use the cliche, the it's not how you start, how you finish, it would apply Chris. right now. A couple Short. innings ago, he had a rough inning. Didn't look good. But now he's starting to settle in a little bit better. He may be able to get through this thing. Chris Short is at the plate here as he quickly finds himself down a strike. It's 0-1. A swing and a miss. He's behind the big curveball. Obviously, he wants to help himself out right here. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. Digging in for his second at bat, Pete Rose. Up, He'll get right. us going in the home half second of inning number run. three. Pete Rose. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Gone to lead off the inning. Solo shot to right center. Second home run early in the year as they take the lead four to three. This is the first home run of the game, but the bats are definitely alive for both teams tonight. There have been a ton of hits already. These pitchers might want to duck and cover if things continue this way. In right now, Frank 20. Robinson. Frank Robinson. There's a swing and a missile sent out to center field. Out of here to the deepest part of the yard. So it's a solo shot to dead center. First home run of the campaign for him. And it's now five to three. Well, in just a little more than two innings of work, he's given up two homers. Could be just one of those games for him. We'll see how much rope they give him. It's definitely getting shorter at the moment. Now batting. Into the box 12. now. Johnson. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Gonzalez has to roam straight back, but he has it for the first down. The batter. First Ready first now. Tony, Tony Perez. Perez. 0 for 1 here in the early going. And he pours this one in at the letters, 0-1. Oh, that's for sure going to be a pitch he wants back. You're not going to get many balls right in the wheelhouse from a top-level arm like this. Lifted in the air out to center field. Gonzalez is right there. Two gone. Now batting the shortstop. Striding in once Tommy again, Tommy Helms. Helms. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Pitch swung on and hit in the air. 
Callison has a read on it. And that ends the inning. So two runs come across here, both coming via the solo home run. Three innings complete. It's the Reds five and the Phillies three. Ready once again, Tony Gonzalez. He'll try to get it going here to begin the fourth. Gonzalez. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Takes a look at one catching the outside corner. Looking at strike two, a fastball that catches the inside corner. Well, it's awful difficult, Matt, to hit when you find yourself down 0-2, but particularly. Looking for the strikeout, here's the 1-2. And this one's chopped foul right at home plate. And now a right-hander's begun to loosen up in the Cincinnati bullpen. Three. And here's a curveball looked at, strike three called, and that's the first out of the inning. Now batting, left fielder. Wes Covington, Covington is in for the third time now as he takes a called strike. It's 0-1. But taken in over at first for the second out as that might have been extra bases if it were three feet now, higher. Third baseman, Dick Allen. Hit on the ground is short. Helms is up with it. Throw in time and the side is retired. Three up, three down for Philadelphia. Still a two-run deficit. It's five to three. Now in the box, Tommy Leading Harper. Off the fourth inning for the Reds. Left Into the windup and Tommy the pitch. Harper. Swing and a ball hit well to the right side, but this will get into the crowd. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. And, and a ball diving into the dirt, a swing and a miss. The lineup top to bottom looks like they have no approach or game plan whatsoever. It's like they're deciding to swing before the pitch is even coming out of the pitcher's hand. Callison is there. Looks it into his glove and there's one gone. Now batting. Number nine. At the plate number nine. He hit a sack fly earlier. The pitch. Ground ball sent back up the middle. Throw to first will get him. Already two away here in the home fourth. Now batting the pitcher. Digging in Sammy, Sammy Ellis. Ellis. Here's the first pitch to him. And this is drifting foul back into the stands. 0 and 1 count and the pitch. Heading out towards shallow right. Callison is there. Makes the catch and that'll retire the side. Reds are down in order as they hang on to their 5-3 lead. Digging in once again. Johnny Callison. He'll look to light a spark under this right lineup that hasn't found Johnny the scoreboard Callison. since back in the first inning. Yeah, and for me, the story has been the starting pitching they faced. It's been very difficult to rebound and, quite frankly, dominate after getting roughed up a bit in the first inning of a start. So I'll give him a lot of credit for what he's been able to do. Into the windup and the pitch. Mm, couldn't quite pull that swing back. He went around for strike one. The pitch. A swinging bunt to the mound. And the fifth inning will start with a ground out, one away. Up next for Philadelphia. Now to the plate, Dick Stewart Dick. comes into this Stewart. at bat, 0 for 1 in the ball game. In there, for strike one, 0 and 1. Swing and that's hit out of play, up into the plaza level. Oh, and this one ran in and got him. And that's twice now he's been hit in this one. I really can't believe that the umpire is letting him stick around here. Number that's 11. the fourth hitter he's plugged. Enough is enough. Get this guy the game before he hurts someone. Stepping in now, number 11, as he will take strike one on the fastball here. No balls and a strike. He's working on a one for two game so far. 
pitch outside the throw. He's in there easily as the throw bounces on the way down. Couldn't lay off that time, and it's one and two. A ball and two strikes. Here's the pitch. Now a swing and a ground ball. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. And he lays off it to even the count two and two. Drill down the line. And he tries for the backhand reach at third, but he gets by the glove down the line. And he is safe on a close play at the plate, and it's back to one now at 5-4. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Number 13. Number 13 is at the plate as he looks at ball one. That one's going to find the seats. Strike one. One and one. Here it is. Fouled off again, and now he's in a one and two hole. Another one sent foul. And a fastball swung on and missed as they set him down for the second time here tonight. Ready for another shot Number now. Now Tony eight. Taylor. Second a bit baseman. suspiciously, Tony he's been hit Taylor. twice in this one. The pitcher number 41. Striding into the box, Chris, Chris Short. Short. And we'll see what he can do here with a pair of runners on base and two gone here in the fifth. Fastball called for strike two. He certainly hasn't been the aggressor in this at bat. Two straight takes. Three. Looking at a fastball to end the inning. He'll have to be content with just the one. Into Leading the box the now, red. number 28. One for two with a number double on his line thus far. This is in the air to left field. Moving under it, Covington. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. The batter number four. Offense, apparently Second not hard to come by tonight as you get a look Rose. at our line score through the first half of the ball game. And boy, the runs have been coming fast and furious so far. Digging in and looking for more. Pete Rose already a home run and a double for him in this one. Now a swing and he pops it foul behind the plate and this will not be caught. It's a foul ball. The wind up and the 0 1. Popped up and there's out number two. Now batting right fielder Frank Robinson. Now batting Frank Robinson. He comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. Into the windup and the pitch. Oh, this one bounces off the pitcher. Recovery throw is not in time, and that'll go down as a painful single. Now so coming to the plate, 12. Johnson has got an RBI despite an 0 for 2 effort to this point. Here's the first pitch to him. Pitch is a cold strike. The throw. Way late, and he's in there easily at second. Five runs, seven hits, and no errors in the game for Cincinnati thus far. Slow curveball, like a balloon, and he couldn't hold back. It's strike two. Well, he's made two tough pitches. He's got a runner at second base, and now he doesn't have to make a good pitch. Make him chase something right here because you don't have to throw him a strike. Looking to keep this a one run game, the pitch. Swing and a miss. Blew the fastball right by him, and the inning is over. Ready for another shot now. Tony Gonzalez. He'll start things out now in the top Center half Hilbert. of the sixth. Tony takes a Gonzalez. knee high fastball. Man, a fastball just misses. It's one and one. This is on the ground over to first. And he'll step on first himself for the out. Now batting, left fielder, Wes Covington. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Wes Covington. First pitch of the at-bat. Swing and a soft liner, and he'll break through with a solid knock here, his first of the ball game. Well, that right there is perfect for taking the ball inside and shooting it the Objects other way. You hear that terminology, hands Aaron inside baseman. the ball. The only way Jeff. you're going to do that is to pull your hands in hard and stay inside the baseball. Nice piece of hitting. Into the box, Dick Allen. As he'll swing and miss it, a first pitch slider at strike one. A hit in two tries for him so far.
lined foul as this gets over the Reds dugout. Has a look now the pitch. Oh, that's out. Not a bad pitch there with two strikes but it misses one and two. Now he gets on top of one here and chops it foul right at home plate. Line toward the alley in left center and that falls in for a solid base hit his second of the night. The tag and they got him at third. What a throw. Up next for Philadelphia. Right fielder. Ready for another Johnny chance. Johnny Callison. In there for strike one. Tying run at first base. He's got to make sure that a ball in the gap he scores. He's got to get a great jump. And one way to do it. Meanwhile here the throw down to second is not in time and it's a stolen base. And he just gets a piece there as this is chopped foul. Swinging a ball hit on the ground. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. But the recovery throw will be in time to first. A good job that time of not giving up on the play, and the inning is. Now some move. Leading off for the red. First baseman, Tony Perez. First pitch on its way. A swing and a drive to center field. That one's got a chance. Gonzalez has room. One out. The batter. Striding in once again. Tommy, Tommy Helms. Helms. Third trip to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. Takes this the other way to right. Callison is there. Two down. The batter. He got that Left one pretty fielder. good. It Tommy just didn't have the right Harper. launch angle to carry over the outfielder's head. Small difference where the ball hit the bat could have made all the difference. Standing in now, Tommy Harper. He swings and grounds it to short, and that finds its way through for a base hit. So that knock keeps the bottom of the sixth inning hot. That's what you call going to the play with a game plan. Oh, oh, count looking for Number a fastball. Nine. He took it right back up the middle. Great execution. Into the box now. Number nine. A pitch out. The throw. Not in time as he's able to thwart the pitch out. Ready with the 1 0. Late that time for a strike. He couldn't quite catch up to that one. He needs to get his foot down and see the fastball out of his hand. Couldn't wait back a swing and a miss. That's so difficult to hit. Hard fastball and a nasty curveball. You just have to sit on one or the other. And threw it right past him a swing and a miss at the gas and that ends the inning. Reds leave one. They lead it five to four. Ready once again, Dick Stewart. Leading a off bit suspiciously, he's First been hit baseman. twice in this one. Yeah. And he tries Stewart. to hold back on the swing, but I think it would have been ruled a strike anyway. It's nothing in one. Just does manage to get a piece there as this is bounced foul. Well, he fouled that breaking ball off a little bit early. Timing not quite there. Had a fastball to pitch before. He just got out in front of that breaking ball. Robinson is over near the stands as he makes the now catch batting. for the first down. Number 11. Number 11 is the batter now as he looks at a ball of 1 and 0. Four runs, eight hits, and no errors on the ledger for the Phillies to this point. And this winds up inside for a ball, 2 and 0 now. And that's swung on and fouled straight back. And he just misses with a curveball. Time to focus here. This game is way too close to be walking, guys, so we'll see if he can make him swing the bat on this next pitch. Oh, and he lets him off the hook there as this isn't even close for ball four. The batter. So a big number moment 13. here and standing in number 13. And he does so representing the possible go ahead run. Well he's thrown a lot of pitches in this one but it's not like he's walking a bunch of guys. And we'll have to leave it there as the play Ladies is made here to end the inning. Now the skipper's on his way out toward the home plate area and I believe that means we're going to have a double Your switch here. Please. Grant Jackson will come on now and he'll slide now into the seventh spot in the lineup following the double switch. 
Cookie Jackson. Rojas is into the ball game as well as he'll slide into the pitcher's spot, hitting ninth now on the double switch. Number 15. Lifted into center field. And the move to the pinch hitter will not pan out as that's taken in for the first out. Now about it. Number Digging in to try it again. Number 28. It was a fly out for him in his last trip. And this is going to find the alley as he might have himself his second double of the ball game. And he'll reach second now with one away. When you're leading by one run, you want to do everything you can to add to the lead to give your bullpen 14. a little breathing room. It makes a big difference. So double here goes a long way towards making that a real possibility. And this one gets away. And over to third now is the runner. Here it comes, 1-0. And he will deliver one of the biggest at-bats of the night. It's a base hit. Coming in to score is the runner from third, and they've pushed it to two here in the seventh. Right fielder number 20. Digging Frank in. Frank Robinson. Robinson. He homered earlier and is two for three to this point. There goes the runner. Pitch outside. The throw. And it skips in as he steals the bag easily. He's ready. Here's the 1-0. Runners on his way to third. Pitches a ball strike. The throw. Not in time as he just does get in there ahead of the throw. A man at third with one away. Tries to drag his way on here, but now he's behind one and two. This is where you got to pitch to the strikeout. Infield's drawn in. You don't want contact. You want to make him swing and miss. There's a swing and a ball hit in the air and a ball that he got every stitch of as that one, without a doubt, is gone. So a two-run shot to left center, his second home run of the game, and they double him up. It's 8-4. to four. Well, there's an old saying that the harder you throw, the farther it goes. How about this? Good fastball, and this ball is absolutely tattooed. See you later. Now batting. In now, Johnson. As the changeup to him drops in there for the first strike. He could really use a knock here, 0 for 3 in the game so far. Skied into straightaway right. Callison will wait on it. And there's the second out of the inning. Now batting. First baseman. Tony Perez. In now. Tony Perez. Into the windup and the pitch. Hard on the ground towards short. Rojas gloves it. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. But they strike for three in the inning. Two on this two-run home run. Seven complete here tonight. It's now eight to four. Roger Craig is out from the bullpen now as he'll be making his first appearance of this young season. Roger Craig. Now batting, Tony Taylor. He'll have a new pitcher waiting for him as we begin the their half of the eighth. Oh, and they come in and get him again. And this is just not how you play the game. Cookie Rojas stands in as he looks at ball one here. 1-0 -oh count. Here it is. On the ground is short. This could be two. There's one. On to first, and they get the double play, but boy, was he ever upended at second base. Digging in once again, Tony Gonzalez. Two away here in the eighth, and time's running out on him, Danny. Yeah, they don't have a lot of outs left to work with, so it's time for someone to make something happen if they're going to get back into this thing. Fastball that time is nowhere close, and it's even at one and one. And here's a ball hit in the air. Johnson is there to make the catch. In the Number 17 takes the mound as he's been called. 
number 17. Hit hard on the ground to second, and that's through for a hit. So it's a leadoff base hit to open their half of the eighth. And there's probably no happier person in the ballpark. Tommy Helms has just collected his first hit in the big leagues. And as is customary, there's the ball being sent into the dugout. Someone will tuck it away for him. And he's into second safely with a stolen base. Now some action in the Phillies bullpen as a right-hander begins to crank it up out there. A swing and a liner to left center field, and that's going to drop in for a base hit. Helms rounds the corner and is headed home. And the runner from second is in to score. Now a 9-4 ball game. How about it? Number Coming nine. to the plate now, number 9. 0 for 2 with a run batted in for him thus far. And there he goes towards second. Pitches a cold strike, the throw. And it's far too late as he steals second with ease. On its way, the 0 1 pitch. And now the runner's trying for third. Pitch inside the throw. Not nearly in time as he takes third easily. And now a bunt attempt here as he gets this one down. And they'll only be able to get the out at first here as the run is in to score from third. How about it? Catcher. Roger Gray. Your Jimmy Coker will get the and call Jimmy here. For the red, number seven, Jimmy Coker. Swing and a looper to left. And that'll get down for a base hit. Number nine batter comes through that time as it'll now be up to the top of the order with one away. Now Coming to the plate now, number, number 28. 28. Two doubles for him to this point in the game. First pitch on its way. Hit back up the middle. He's got it to second for one, but they won't get two as he beats the relay to first. Digging in the switch hitter, Keith Rose. And he's got a shot at history here, but he'll need a triple to complete the cycle. But the runner's back easily. First pitch coming. Here it is. Pitch is a cold strike. The throw. Way late, and he's in there easily at second. Runner in scoring position at second with two down. Now a shot toward the gap in left center. And the run is in to score from second. Runner around second now, headed for third. The tag, and he is out at third. And with that, the side is retired. Number 41 is on, and he'll take over on the mound in relief. Digging in and looking for more, Wes Covington starting things for his side in the ninth as they face the improbable odds of trying to come back in this one. Yeah, not a lot of hope for them at this point. These guys know these bats still count, at least for their own stats. You can't mill in your chances as a professional. Dick Allen comes on with one away as he looks at a ball. It's 1-0. Hey, that's a good pitch right there. But, you know, as a base dealer, when you're in a box like that, you want to protect your money makers, right? You don't want anything around your knees or your feet. So he was fortunate to get out of the way of that one. Ready on one and two. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Robinson going back. He's got it. A nice play there. Two away. How about him? Stepping up now, Johnny Callison. Callison. And oh my, that pitch is behind him up around the shoulders, and he won't like that much. Wow, I'm not sure that one passed the eye test. I mean, there had to be some intent behind that one right there. Ouch, that one hit him. And I'm sure that one stings a little bit. The best revenge he can get for his pain is to find a way to come around to score. We'll see if his guys can move him around the bases. Dick Stewart is in with two away now as he looks at a called strike one. I like the aggressiveness, Matt. He hits the batter, then he comes right back with the fastball and says, dare you to hit it. I'm coming after you. 
Grounded back up the middle. Fielded cleanly. Throw on to first is going to be in time to take care of him. And the Reds have taken games one and two here at home as this one is over. Hey, it always feels good to win a baseball game, but when you can win one at home in front of your home crowd, all those the fans cheering, this is a good win tonight. for this team. 11 4 at the end of this affair. The Cincinnati Reds slugged their way to victory with 15 hits. Sammy.